going to ask you again, are our schools safe? Speaking before members of the Chesterfield County School Board, state and county health officials reassured leaders that schools were safe. This despite the findings of an investigation that showed no conclusive link between an outbreak of Legionnaire's disease and several school cooling towers. One significant finding is that we could not identify the source of the cluster based on the molecular testing. This summer, the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention and the Virginia Department of Health found many of the cooling towers were dirty and a handful had levels of the Legionella bacteria associated with Legionnaire's disease. Five Chesterfield County schools tested positive for the bacteria. Health officials immediately suggested a thorough cleaning of all the cooling towers. We are not seeing ongoing cases at this time. Earlier in the afternoon, Chesterfield school officials also confirmed to school board members that all water systems had been cleaned and tested negative for the Legionella bacteria. It's a thing of the past for us that uh, everything is clean, everything is running well, and we are checking weekly and working with uh, risk management to make sure uh, that we're following all the CDC and health guidelines. But some parents and a handful of school board members voiced concern over the lack of transparency during the investigation, including why test results of other facilities, including Johnston Willis Hospital, were not released. Am I getting the whole story? Am I getting one piece of the investigation? Inquiries that caused one school board member to defend the health department. I'm sorry for how you've been talked to this evening because we wouldn't be here tonight if our cooling towers had been Now, school leaders say they will continue working with the private contractor Water Chemistry Incorporated to clean cooling towers now until the end of the year.